Hallelujah. Salvation and glory. Honor and power unto the Lord our God. For the Lord our God is mighty. Yes, the Lord our God is omnipotent. The Lord our God, he is wonderful. God bless you. God is good. Just going to say a quick prayer, okay? We're going to say a quick prayer and then I'm going to get out of your way. I promise not to be on for too long. Okay, hey, guess what? Guess what happened today? Now I really know that God is working on me. In Jesus' mighty name. Guess what happened today? Blessings from CT. Where's CT? Guess what happened? Hallelujah. You know what I'm singing? Listen, you really want to hear what happened? Lord Jesus, God blessed me today. Guess what? Connecticut, God bless you. Connecticut. Listen, I went out to Ross. And guess what? Didn't buy no Jordans. This is Charmaine called. I did not buy no Jordans. That's how I know I'm delivered. My God, that's how I know I'm delivered. I did not buy no Jordans. I didn't. I did not buy no Jordans. My God. Oh, Jesus, I did it. Honestly, when I, when I told you I wasn't going to do it, I wasn't sure if I could stick to it. But I'm, I'm telling you, I know that shopping demon has been broken off me. My God, he's, bro he's gone. No longer bound. No more chains holding me. My soul is resting. <laughs> Listen, that song is real. I'm not bound in Jesus' name. Yes, Lord, I'm free. Jesus is Lord. We bless his name. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. We magnify him. He's worthy of all the praise and the glory. Without him, we're nothing. With him, we have everything. Everything belongs to him. We are so blessed to have him as our savior, the king of kings and the lord of lords. The one who died and rose again on the third day according to the scriptures. Help me celebrate tonight because I'm free in Jesus' name. We love the Lord. We love the Lord. We love the Lord. Now listen, you know, this morning's word was so powerful. Ezekiel chapter 6 verse 11 and Ezekiel chapter 25 verse 6. I keep telling you, all that the enemy does is a counterfeit. That's all. All the enemy does is counterfeit. Counterfeit what works. The enemy watches and studies, looks at the things that work. You know, it was so amazing today when I went into the store. And, uh, you know, whenever, I, you know, and, and, and this happens, this happens a lot. When you take out a hundred dollar bill to pay for something, they've got this pen. You know, there's this pen that they scribble, you know, on the hundred dollar bill. You know why? Because they're checking to see if it's real. They don't do that for any other, you know, denomination. You know what I'm saying? They don't do that. But when it comes to that, that's the counterfeit marker. Thank you. Because they're trying to check. That's why I don't understand those of you who are saved. Why don't you use a counterfeit pen in the realms of the spirit to check some of these so-called prophets who keep asking you for money? When they're checking, do you get upset? You know when they're checking that money, do you get upset? Do you ask them, why are you checking it? Is it because I'm black? Is it because this? Is it because that? You don't. Because you have belief in the money that you're giving them to know that it is the original and it's authentic. You see what I'm saying? So I don't know why some of us get duped every day. The devil is a liar. You, you, need, to have, you need to have some Holy Ghost, my God, on the inside of you so you can check these counterfeit spirits. In the name of Jesus, let your spiritual antennae work. In Jesus' name, 
the tornadoes that has been coming, devil is a liar. We speak to you. We command you to cease. We command you to bow. Peace be still. And know that Jesus is Lord. My God, Jesus is Lord. That's the name that we know. I said Jesus is Lord. We bless his name and we magnify him. He is the King of Kings and the Lord of Lords. Yes, Lord, we worship him. Yes, Lord, we honor him. Yes, Lord, we magnify him. In the mighty name of Jesus, in this season of severe weather, we are not ignorant of the devil's devices. We are not ignorant of what the devil seeks to do. We know the God that we serve, and we know that he is more than able in Jesus' mighty name. We lift him up and we say yes to his will. We lift him up and we say yes to his will. We lift him up and we say yes to his will. In the mighty name of Jesus, thank you, God. Yes, Lord, Father God, we thank you for purging us. Open up your mouth this hour. Open up your mouths. In the mighty name of Jesus, open up your mouths this hour. Yes, Lord, we honor you. In the mighty name of Jesus, Vazovo de Valivria. Rebuke that witchcraft activity. Open up your mouths and rebuke it. In the name of Jesus, speak to that principality and that power and that voice that wants to destroy and to mess with you. Speak to that thing. Ah, enemy, you've come so far. Please back off my house, back off my children, back off my destiny. In the mighty name of Jesus. You know, I spoke to one of our sisters this morning. And she was sharing with me an experience that she had in a church where the preacher told, you know, the congregation that, you know, they don't need to be praying and doing all that kind of warfare. You know, said it's not needed. All they got to do is, be, is to be positive, you know. You know, a lot of churches preach about positive energy. You know that? They're taking out the Holy Ghost and they preach about positive energy. You can be all positive that you want. That's fine. You, you, you carry on being like that, okay? Tell that church, God bless them. They should carry on you can preach positive energy as long as you want. When the demons come, you 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 will see if your positive energy will, will, will help you. You know, I don't fight nobody. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We've seen too much. Sister Takaya, been to churches, mega, 10,000 people. Half of the people there were demons. Halalabas here in America. Yes, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus, you can speak all positive as you want. I come with the name. I don't come with no other name. Do you see what I'm saying? I don't come with no theology. I don't come to try and make myself intellectually intelligent. All I know is the name. When I walk into a place and I smell a foul spirit in that place, it is not my positive energy that is going to drive that demon out. It is the name Jesus Christ. My God, the one who died and rose again on the third day. Open up your mouth with me this morning, this afternoon, this evening. Different time zones represented on here. Begin to call upon the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. For the Lord our God is mighty. The Lord, the God that we serve is omnipotent. Uh, he's everywhere. Nobody, nothing can bypass him. In the name of Jesus. I'm praying this hour that your Holy Ghost, you know, when you're sleeping, your Holy Ghost ain't sleeping. The Holy Ghost can communicate with you what the enemy is plotting and planning as the guards have been changed. There is a changing of the guards. In the realms of the spirit, there is a different agenda that is going to be pushed in this season. But your Holy Ghost won't go to sleep. Open up your mouth. La bla sukala la basia. Vazo vodeva. Cover your workplace with the blood of Jesus. Cover your business in the blood of Jesus. Take a comprehensive insurance over your life, over your business, over your children. Listen to me. Your children will not become breaking news. Their schools will not be on CNN and Fox News. Their schools will not become a target for the wicked one in Jesus' name. That's the name I know. Yes, Lord. Balalabasia. Now listen to me, those of you who don't pray no more on under 7 p.m., you know the prayer line, you know God told us to pray at 7 p.m., 
You remember that? Some of you need to repent because you stopped doing it. You need to find yourself back in that place. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Yes, Lord. I receive power to prosper. Yes, Lord. We're in receipt of your email. I receive power to prosper. In the name of Jesus. Vazavadava. Yes, Lord. Sir, you talking about me? Sir, Sir Don? Am I okay? I appreciate that comment if it's for me. God bless you. In the name of Jesus. We bless the name of Jehovah. Call upon the name of Jehovah. My God. Call upon his name. In the name of he's the only one that can. Yes, sir. God bless you. Vazovo. Balalabasia. My God, call upon his name. I'm calling on everybody's name. You know, calling on all them preachers. They ain't got no power. What you need is Jesus. Call unto me. And I will answer you. And show you great and mighty things which you don't even know. Your problem is you're calling everybody else. You're calling Johnny. You're calling Biggie. You're calling Tupac. You're calling... Drake, you're calling Beyonce, you're calling Pop Daddy, you're calling who else? Who who are these latest uh, artists? Those are the names that you're calling on. You ain't calling on that name Jesus. He said, He said, call on me. And when you call me, I'm going to answer you. Better call upon his name. Call upon his name. Yeshua Hamashiach. The king of kings and the lord of lords, your redeemer, he lives, he's not dead. See, he died, but listen, his death wasn't because he couldn't keep himself alive. He had to die to go and take the keys from that devil. He had to go claim those keys back and say, hey, you remember the keys that you stole from Adam? Give me back those keys because I gave it to Adam. The Bible says he kicked the devil. He, he destroyed the devil. And then he bound the devil up in chains. He said, listen, you keep yourself here. I'm going to go back and give them authority. I'm going to give them what they lost once before. And if they call upon my name and they make a connection with me, then I will come and I will heal their land. Listen to me. If your land is cursed, if your land is barren, could it be because you're not calling on him because if you call on him he is listen he is mandated to come and heal your land please that preacher that you keep calling ain't gonna help you that's why they're not being responding to your calls because they know they can't help you because your issue is too much for them they can't help you brother sister I'm sorry to be the one who is, listen, break, you know, breaking this news to you. They can't, that's why they're not answering your call. That's why your call cannot get through. What you need to do is find yourself in this place called Knee City. K-N-E-E. -E. You know where Knee City is? That is behind or that is by your bed. Before you jump in the bed and before you get out of that bed, you need to find yourself in Knee City. And what is now in Knee City, that is when you begin to grapple with the thing that is trying to consume and, or, or destroy you. That's where you need to be. Find yourself in Knee City. Cry unto him. So you call on me, I'm going to answer you. I'm on the other end of the phone. See, if you don't call me, because the Bible says, he said, I stand at the door and knock. That's, that's you know, that's, that's another. I stand at the door and knock. My God. You're so caught up on social media. You got all of these earphones in your ears. The, 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 the master is standing at the door knocking, but you can't hear him. Because some of you, when you get on the phone, it is a battle to get you off the phone. You know, you see some calls coming through your phone and you, lo you know, you're like, Lord Jesus, if I answer this call, that's at least an hour out of my day. You know that. You know, there's some people, when you see, the when you see your phone ringing, you're like, Lord Jesus, what's it going to be? <laughs> what's it going to be? You know, should I just wait for it to run out? You know, to ring out. 
you know, I just, I'll just, I'll just wait for it to ring out. Cause listen, as soon as I answer this call, that is at least one hour out of my day. And I ain't got one hour to spare. One hour I don't have. Silver and gold have I none. But such as I have I give unto you. In the name of Jesus. I ain't got no time to waste. So I'll wait for the phone to ring out. Pretend like I never heard you ring. I never heard you phone me. Because I know one hour is out of my day. My God. To repent afterwards. Lord Jesus help me. In the mighty name of Jesus, we claim, Michelle, that cancer will not be, brain tumor will not be her portion. In the name of Jesus, we speak into that vacuum that that brain tumor has now begun to be, has now, has now taken residence. In the name of Jesus, let's begin to call upon Jehovah. La prasu kalalabasia, vazevodeva, leprandi kaprasu kalalabasia. In the mighty name of Jesus, 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 in the mighty name of Jesus. Sickness receive the mighty name of Jesus and bow. Poverty receive the mighty name of Jesus and be destroyed in the mighty name of Jesus. We magnify him, King of kings and Lord of lords, Alpha and Omega. Yes, Lord. Lamb of God, thank you for today. Lamb of God, thank you for today. Lamb of God, thank you for today. In the name of Yeshua the Christ, the Son of the living God. We bless his name, we magnify him, and we adore him. So shall it be. In Jesus' mighty name. Yes, Lord. Thank you, Holy Ghost. Thank you, Holy Ghost. In the mighty name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. It is so. Amen. Now, God bless you, okay? I'm going to get out of your way. I just came to pray with you quickly. Now, remember that every evening at 7 p.m., the prayer line is open for you to go and make your prayer deposit. You hear me? Every evening, please do not miss out. That's for you and between you and God. Yes, Lord. We magnify him. We say glory be to his name. Hallelujah. What is the number for the evening prayer call? Somebody type it out for me. In Jesus' name, we bless his name. 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 I am in Jacksonville. In the mighty name of Jesus. Vazovodeva. La prasutalalabasia. Sister Janil, God bless you. Vazovo. La prasutalalabasia. Somebody's going to type up the number very soon. Somebody put the prayer line number up for me, please. In the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. In the mighty name of... It is on the website, yes. Father, we bless your name. We bless your name. We bless your name. We thank you this hour for deliverance and breakthrough. We thank you for manifest manifestation. We thank you in the mighty name of Jesus. I receive that in Jesus' name. You know, man of God said the hand of God is on. I receive that in Jesus' name. The website. Okay, so that's the number. Seven, seven, one, seven, seven, seven. You sure that's the number? Sister Tara? That's the number. Confirm, confirm it, please. Keep putting it up. Keep putting it up, please. Tornadoes hit Georgia. We're praying. We're praying. We're praying that the saints will be saved. In Jesus' name. Oh, Dr. Dr. Daniels, that's the woman of God. I'm going to call her. You know, powerful woman of God. I learned so much from her. In Jesus' mighty name. La blasuta la la basia. Now listen, if you sow into prayer mantle and you're not, you're, you're not part of the WhatsApp group, please make sure, okay? Oh, that's your pastor. You're, you're sitting under the best pastor in the whole wide world. I'm pretty serious. Powerful woman of God. Oh, New York. My God. Please, God, help. What's the WhatsApp group? You know, people who support this ministry. 
people who support this ministry you know I've, you know there's a group that we formed okay if you sow and you've never received well okay this is what you do please email prayer mantle you know prayer mantle 3 at gmail.com with your number and we'll add you to the group okay yes yeah, she was with apostle john eckhart yeah i'm gonna call her i just want her to rest i don't want to disturb her i mean you know jacksonville you know i'm sorry okay i'm going back tomorrow to new york we we speak peace be still in jesus mighty name vazavadeva prasukalabasia in jesus name yes lord we'll, we'll, another opportunity will come okay another another opportunity will come when i when i go to new york i'm going to be in a place called baldwin that's all i know in jesus name yes lord oh okay i'm going to call i'm going to call apostle daniels in jesus name yeah baldwin that's what it's called in jesus name vaso vodeva labra sutalala kcc uh, okay, when I come, I'm going to come back again. I promise you. Okay, I will. I will tell her, man of God, Troy. I'm going to. I'm going to call your name when I call her. I wanted to call her earlier on, but I just wanted. You know, I didn't want to disturb her. KCC, I'll, I'll be coming back. I'm not speaking in Baldwin. No, Baldwin. My brother lives there. But you know, when I was in Baldwin, I, I met a group of you know prayer mantle people. You know, we we met at is it TGI Fridays? Yeah. This is Charmaine. God bless you. Time will come. Don't worry. We'll meet the time at the right time. I believe in God's timing. You know, we can meet today, and nothing will happen. You know, but when we meet at the at the time that God has said, Hey, yes, Lord divine timing but he might need to go through samaria you know what i'm saying that, that there is there is a time that has been orchestrated by god for everything seasons in jesus name yes lord god's time god's time is the best we bless his name we magnify him make sure every evening Oh, wow, Barbados, wow. Every evening, make sure you're on the prayer line. Okay, when you go on there, it's you and God. All you need is seven minutes. Talk to him, then you leave. You see what prayer has done for us so far? One of my sisters called me today, you know, on prayer mantle. I just told her, transparent. She asked me, I just told her, you know, we need to be very guarded in the, you know why they laugh at us in the world? Social media has allowed the dirty linen of the church to become public. You hear me? Social media has allowed the dirty linen of the church to become public. Some things that we were able to hide for years, we can no longer hide. You see what I'm saying? Some things that you could do and you know the only people who will know is the people in your church well it don't work like that no more when you're the preacher and you mess around all somebody needs to do is just go on social media and you're done and so now in the 21st century church we need to confront some of this stuff and we need to deal with it ain't no hiding no more you see what i'm saying ain't no hiding no more can't be abusing, manipulating, lying, and think you're going to get away with this. Somebody's going to call you out on social media. Somebody's going to say something. And some of the stuff which is true, we need, we need to say, hey, listen, what you're doing is wrong. You need to repent, whether you are a preacher, whether you're in the, you know, whether you're in the pew. Because the world, you know, the world is not forgiving. Somebody keep putting the, 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 the prayer line number up, okay? And, and that's why you and I need to be in a place where we're matured enough. Okay? We're matured enough not to allow. 
you know, mess to follow us. Get your emotions in check. You know, sometimes just because somebody shows you attention, and listen to me, especially when you've been single for a long time, or 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 when uh you know, or when you know uh you haven't had anybody show you attention. If you're not careful, you will get your emotions in a fix, and the person will end up abusing you. Now listen, when I'm talking, all you need to do is just catch the revelation. That's all. You see what I'm saying? I love you. Some of you I might never meet, but I'm telling you, okay, if you ever heard this African boy say anything to you, all I would tell you is the truth. God bless you. Have a blessed evening. You see what I'm saying? Because I'm tired of the mess. You know what it feels like sometimes to hear the phone, to, hear, to listen to what people have gone through? And I'm like, Lord Jesus, what is going on? So all you've got to do is catch the revelation. I told you this, there is an epidemic coming, but it's already here. I told you, there is an epidemic coming, but it's already here. What do I mean? It's coming, but it's here. Some of it is coming, but some of it has already come. And it's an epidemic of mess. And some of you have become prisoners in the mess that you found yourself in. Not because, you know, you were just innocent. Thank you. I appreciate you too. You know, I don't know what to say anymore. You know, I was talking to Mother Khan this morning as we drove to the store. You know, and I said, Mom, I don't even know what to say to the people anymore. Because, you know, some people, they might feel like you're jealous because they're going to get their breakthrough through that man of God. I said, what have I got to be jealous of? I've, I've, you, listen, I've got Jesus on my side. Do you see what I'm saying? Praying for your father. Ah, praying for your father. I felt some, sorry, sorry. I felt something when I said that about your father. In e Was he in ER4? I'm sorry. Sorry. Was he there for? Halalaba, see Something in right. God needs to get him out of there. What is he there for? Jesus. I'm sorry. Don't be scared, okay? If, if it's your first time, you know, I just allowed the Holy Ghost to move. What is he there for? Was your father in ER for? Emergency room. Was he there for? Why has he been taken in there? Hey! Jesus. Sorry. <laughs> you know, I get scared sometimes of myself. You're not answering me. What's your father in ER for? Ah, Jesus. What's his name? If you don't mind me asking. I feel something. It's not right. You know, something is not right. You know. Collapsed at dinner. The devil is a liar. Whoever is behind, who, who, whatever is behind. See, the problem is not the collapsing. It's, what, it's what's going on behind the scenes. That's what we need to tap into and get him out. In Jesus' name. In the name of Jesus. We call our father out of that emergency room. In the name of Jesus. My God, I feel a spirit of prayer coming upon me. Hey, halalabasia, mandalalabasia, Jesus. We're going to take his name out of that trap. Whoever has got his name, whoever thinks they're going to exchange his name. Yes, Lord, from the land of the living, this man will not leave the land of the living today. You are a liar. The devil is a liar. You better leave him alone. Before we expose you in Jesus' name, give him back his life. Halalabasia. Man dololobosha. In the name of Jesus, we say give him back his life. In Jesus' name. Holy Ghost, you know who he is. 
we send ministering angels to locate him. Yes, Lord. Halalaba. Sato. Tha. Jesus. Call him out. He's alive. He ain't going to die. He will live to declare the goodness of Jehovah. Yes, Lord. Allen. We cancel bleeding in Jesus' name. Die in your portion. In the name of Jesus, there is a body of believers praying. You need to listen, open up your mouth and pray. Declare into the atmosphere. Alan is in ICU bleeding. The devil is a liar. Listen, this is 2017. Jesus has already bled for us. Ain't no sense in you bleeding in this season when, listen, Jesus has already done the bleeding for you and I. We command the bleeding to cease. Like the woman with the issue of the blood. When she came and she touched Jesus. We connect Alan to Jesus this hour. We connect the tubes to Jesus. We don't connect the tubes to any machine. But we connect the tubes spiritually to Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. Balalabasia. Vazovo. Lipro. We clean out his blood. We cancel poisoning. We clean out his blood in the name of Jesus. It is well. Hey, I felt that. It is well. Vazovo. Pasikalalabasia. It is well. We release him. We discharge him. I say we discharge him. We discharge him. We discharge him by the Holy Ghost. The Holy Ghost signs his release papers this hour. You hear me? I said the Holy Ghost signs his release documents this hour. He is not bound in that ICU. Yes, Lord. In Jesus' name. God is good. God is good. Who oh Lord is God that why I came, you know, I was fighting whether to come on. But I believe it's God who brought me on Periscope tonight. In Jesus' name. I gotta go. Uh, there's prayer for the partners in ten minutes. That's how we operate on prayer mantle. The partners have their own, you know, the part everybody who is a partner. You are commanded to be on that prayer line. You know, you pray yourself. I, I, I need you to increase your prayer life. When you get around me, you will pray till you get fed up of praying. I need you to become infected with the virus of prayer. When anything comes across you, you just say, hey, this is a prayer person. You better leave before you get exposed in Jesus' name. So every Every person who sows into prayer mantle, if you've never been on the prayer line for the prayer for the partners, you, you need to start asking questions why. Okay, so you need to email prayer mantle and say, Hey, I need to be part of this group. Because everybody gets the chance to pray for seven minutes every day. Every you know, it's 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 like a, a rotor. So everybody prays. Okay, that's for all the partners, financial partners. I just don't want you to give, I want you to back it up with prayer. I want you to back it up with prayer. I want you to back it up with prayer. You hear me? Back it up with prayer. When you give, you back it up with prayer. Be infected with a virus called prayer. In Jesus' name. Now, God bless you. I'm waiting for the good report to come, okay? In Jesus' mighty name, God bless you. Those of you who support this ministry, thank you so much. Thank you for your consistency. I know it's not easy all the time. I know it's not easy all the time. But your consistency has been a blessing. And I pray that the good Lord will not forget about you. What you have placed in the bowl of prayer, what your sacrifice ah, has been in this season, the Spirit of the Lord will answer you in Jesus' name. God bless you. Thank you for your support. If you're thinking about supporting the ministry 
always I always tell you pray about it let the Lord direct you let the Lord lead you on what to do and support us okay in Jesus mighty name he's worthy of all the praise and the glory you are blessed and highly favored God bless you God bless you God listens to you don't let the devil deceive you you better you better, you better open up your mouth and pray he's always listening it's the devil that's making you feel like that you hear me don't entertain that thought that's not from God that is not from God. He listens to you. He knows everything about you. Develop yourself in prayer. And you will see the goodness of Jehovah. God richly bless you. Okay? God richly bless you. Have a blessed evening. You know, get something to eat. Watch, watch a little bit of TV. Not too much. Read your word. Ezekiel chapter 6 verse 11. Ezekiel chapter 25 verse 6. In Jesus name. I will I'll call Apostle. God bless you. Have a blessed evening. Goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.